Hey, what's up, everyone? Joy Allison, the Nintendo Brony here. Ready to be adding some more MLP. I mean, I got some more milk, like I said I would. Binge watching some more of the Canadian early releases of the My Bone Adventures Magic. If you, um, if you guys are confused and you guys have been keeping up with the U.S. releases and you are confused and it's like, when did this episode come out? Um, let me go ahead and give a quick reminder. In Canada, the channel for MLP, which is the Treehouse Network, got permission from Hasbro to release the episodes faster than other countries. What they're doing is they release an episode on Saturday and release another episode Sunday. So, each week, they have two brand new episodes. Unlike other countries, each week we get one brand new episode. So, they've been going faster than us. And some pe and people have been uploading the Treehouse Network versions to Daily Motion. I have not been on the find the Discovery Family versions lately. So, yes. <coughs> Anyways, guys, let's go ahead. Uh, today, we're going to be reacting to My Little Pony Friendship's Magic Season 7, Episode 10, Royal the Royal Problem. <coughs> right here, Royal, I can only think of Twilight, Celestia, Luna, Cadence, maybe Shining Art since he's technically a prince now, or maybe even their baby, Flurry Heart. One of those two, or not two, one of those six. Or maybe Queen Crystal's return, for all I know. But I'll say that for a season finale. Anyways, guys. I do actually know who will be in this episode, and that is Starlight Glimmer. So, we're going to get to see more Starlight Glimmy Glam. Um, so, yes, guys. Let's go ahead and get into this episode with some delicious milk and popcorn. In uno, dos... Trace, I don't know how to say play in Spanish. Wait. I know! I can't believe it either! The map has never called me before! Uh, it's called Star 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 Star? She looks like that. Oh, uh, <laughs> actually it is. Well it's that and Well, I make this smaller real quick. Because uh but <laughs> <coughs> Oh my god, the map called Starlight. We always think it was calling calling the main six, and I was wondering when are we gonna get another map episode? Is that we're gonna do that again for season seven? They did it for season five, and they redid it in season six. Have three map episodes, each one involving two of the main six. But now I was like, okay, are we gonna do that again for season seven? We are, but not the same way. We're getting one where it's calling Starlight Glimmer and just Starlight Glimmer. Is it this season we're gonna? Here's my prediction. This season, we're going to get three map episodes like usual, but they're each going to involve background characters, or not background, but new characters that have either been reformed or just like introduced lately and are just now getting like, for example, they're called Starlight. So maybe the next one they'll call Trixie, or um, the next one, who else? Uh, for all I know, the third one could call end up calling Maud. <laughs> I would laugh hysterically because then we would actually be able to see what Mont's actual official cutie mark <coughs> cutie mark is. Oh my God! So yes, I approve of Starlight being and called the by that. Being called to the royal palace. <laughs> what an equestria could be going on there? Do you want me to come with Wait, you? Wait, the royal no, palace? I shouldn't. The royal palace. Just oh, called can't you for a reason, right? <laughs> Though maybe it's a mistake. <laughs> Not because of you, because it's never called just one of us what? before. Twilight is so obedient to the map. I also wasn't nervous before, but now... Don't worry, we're only going to something small. Twilight makes all the ponies nervous. Maybe the cubs are fighting over who has the best butternut squash soup. Twilight's nervousness is contagious, isn't it? Or, you know, maybe the royal sisters aren't seeing eye to eye on something. No! It's just crazy. Luna and Celestia would never fight. Again. Celestia and Luna... Yeah, they fought before. They might have... So the map sent you? Solve a friendship problem? Yes, princess. <coughs> well, there's oh, nothing weird. wrong here, <laughs> right, sister? No, everything's perfect as usual. Luna, sister. what's going on? Luna has a grudge against Celestia. I'm guessing. My oh my god. Pony, my okay. 
Okay, so we saw some tension with Luna right there. Luna... I feel like Luna doesn't like Celestia for some odd reason. So, uh, Celestia is a little bit more cheerful to say, Oh, nope, yep, yeah, everything's fine over here. We're at high and dandy. And Luna's like, oh, um, yeah, I fucking hate you, bitch. <laughs> but seriously, what the heck? Okay. So, <laughs> so Starlight gets to stay there. I mean, it's probably not too different from Twilight. Well, actually, it's different from Room Twilight's Castle. Twilight? What the heck? Is that you? Oh you my god. Oh, I'm still home. It's an easy spell. I'll show you later. Anyway, enough of me. <coughs> I had to check on you, not in a meddling kind of way, in a friendly how's it going kind of way. So, how's it going? Not great. Celestia's a little more cheerful and Luna's more. Be between Celestia and Luna. Yeah. Oh no, that's terrible. I mean, what <laughs> makes you say that? <laughs> you know how some ponies say nothing's wrong, but you can tell something's definitely wrong? Oh. oh. <laughs> that's basically what the princesses did when I said there was a friendship problem. Only they did it more, you know, regally. Oh, I wish regally. I could help you, but I can't. Both for map reasons and because I have no idea. Why I like the ballerina. <laughs> Thank you so much for breakfast, Princess. I can't believe you cook it yourself. Celestia, what's course, wrong? Starlight? I really enjoy doing what's wrong, it. Celestia? It's a small way to say I care. Okay, I think Celestia Morning, is normal, sister. but Luna is Join bitchy us. as fuck. Too tired. What the heck are all Luna's eyes? Luna, have you not been getting sleep? You're the princess of the fucking night. Last night must have been really hard on her. <laughs> uh, perhaps, but she is like this every morning. Wait, really? Dump your pancakes away, you should have fed into me. Luna may be hurting her sister's or at least Starlight. without even realizing it. Poor Celestia. That's so sweet that she makes her sister pancakes every morning. She's your mentor. I think you might be biased. Fair enough. <laughs> so what are you gonna do? Nothing. She's your yes. mentor. Think you might be biased, Twilight. I asked Luna if I could spend some time with her this evening. Princess Luna's waiting for you, Miss. <laughs> Princess Luna, what do you want? Good luck, Starlight. Calming scent is known to aid dreamers in achieving a restorative sleep. <laughs> that's, that's good. That's so thoughtful. I try my best to make sure the ponies in this castle sleep peacefully. You are the princess of night and dream. More like boring. <laughs> Who are these ponies? Are a card. One's a crystal empire one. I don't know who you two are. But as always, my sister is too busy having fun with dignitary ponies to acknowledge anything I do. Oh, uh, I get it. Luna doesn't feel appreciated. So, both princesses are hurting each other without realizing it. <laughs> and instead of talking about it, they're just getting colder and more distant. Then tell and them! Celestia and Luna, so it's not like you can just confront them. Actually, that's exactly what I was gonna do. What? <laughs> are you crazy? <laughs> I mean, you do whatever you think is best. This is your mission. What? Are you crazy? Thanks for believing me, Twilight. Step by I do, but the last time the princesses fought, Luna turned into Nightmare Moon, and Princess Celestia had to banish her for a thousand mm. years. That can't happen again. Well, I can't do nothing. The princesses aren't the best at communicating with each other. <gasps> Sorry, it's just you said princesses and aren't the best in the same sentence, and it's making me nervous. Twilight I'm not much help, am I? <laughs> <coughs> You're not helping Starlight converse. Wow. Feel bad eating this. It's adorable. Like Aww. I said, I enjoy this. Smiley face pancake. And here comes freaking bitchy ass Luna. Uh, she eats the peel. What the heck? <laughs> God, I do not want to see that face in the morning. As you both know, the map is here for a reason, and I think I found Luna out need some what fucking it coffee. is. Really? That is wonderful, Starlight. What is it? 
You too. Excuse Thank me. Your pardon. <laughs> I think you're accidentally hurting each other's feelings without realizing it. Princess Celestia, does it bother you that Luna never notices the wonderful breakfast that you prepare for her? Uh, yes, it does. Yeah, I'll be honest with each other's feelings Princess before it breaks Luna, into something much bigger, Celestia, like Nightmare Moon 2.0. Just say it, Luna. I'm Just sorry, say it, Celestia. I've never noticed that you make fruit faces on pancakes. <laughs> but nights are long for me. You might be a morning pony, but I am half asleep. Oh, because Luna's... I don't get tired? I'm exhausted. Oh, I apologize for not noticing flowers in a wall sconce. But by the time I get to retire for the night, I can barely see straight. Even so, I still make an effort to smile. <laughs> like smiling <laughs> so hard. I I'm sure that's not what Princess Luna oh, meant crap. to say. Is that what exhausts you? Smiling Please don't turn into Nightmare Moon 2.0, Luna. But you have it so much worse, do you? You've spent your evenings flipping around giving ponies lovely dreams. Oh, it sounds just awful. Oh, it is harder <laughs> okay. than that. Oh, I my like God. Step back. Take a deep breath. <laughs> don't press <pretend. laughs> This is a move star out of the way. What? Now you'll know exactly what it's like to be each other. She switched three cutie Mario. What have you done? I went with my gut. Switch out cutie marks back this instant. Oh, my apologies, your majesties, but I can't, even if I wanted to. This spell lasts 24 hours. It may have been extreme, but uh, I think it's still a good idea. You did that on purpose. What? <laughs> oh, God, they're going to kill you, Starlight. Your <laughs> sister knows how hard it is to be you. So this is your chance to prove it. Well, I could use an easy day followed by a good night's sleep. You can try. I haven't had an easy day in well ever. But now uh... I get to sleep and tonight will be a breeze. <laughs> All right, Starlight Glimmer, we will do this. Good oh, choice. Now that you had one. Down accepted. <laughs> I'm going to stop talking now. Yay, Ben. That's my cutie marks. Twilight gang comma shit now. Uh, Twilight shit will never be calm. Yep. Yeah, Are you okay, sir? <laughs> I'm good. Just uh. Twilight is hyperventilating on the extreme. He's gonna think I'm nuts. He's not the only one. <laughs> <laughs> As you can see, <laughs> Celestia <laughs> and I are switching places today. <laughs> mm -hmm. I assure you, I am more than capable of handling all of Celestia's <laughs> duties. Dismissed. Oh, Luna, you cocky ass bitch. I'll see you handle it. What is first on my dear sister's to-do list? It says you have a few public appearances. Store openings, judging the Royal Rose Contest, you know, that sort of thing. <laughs> oh, I knew today would be easy, but I didn't think it would be that easy. <laughs> <laughs> when the smiling and waving gets to be too much, I can't do Um, the smiling and waving just gets to freaking get make you go. <laughs> you can't cut a ribbon. <laughs> oh, Luna's not into this kind of stuff. Go around in the day. What the heck, Luna? Seriously? Just, just smile? Okay. Uh, I didn't mean for that to happen. 
Damn, you, but you fucked can't dwell it on that all now. up. According to the list, some delegates are about to arrive for a luncheon. You need to dispel rumors of timber wolves in the Whitetail Woods. The nearby towns have been in a state of panic for weeks. But, but I have to fix this. You can't. You need to put on a brave face and help these ponies. It's what Celestia would do. Yes. That went back in season two. Students. Normally, I have all the time, <coughs> and I need to work through my problems at my own pace. Well, your sister doesn't get that luxury. Ready for the town hall? <sighs> Good luck. Good luck, Luna. You're gonna need it. That's <laughs> settled. Took three hours. Oh, that got seated, didn't it? Oh, still on for golf. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> you made it to the end of the day. Yay? Hmm? Oh, yes, sir. <sighs> I'm just going to turn in then. Good light, Starlight. The heck? Uh. Oh, hello, Starlight. I don't know about you, but I feel very well. So, what's the princess of the night? Luna? Um, uh, she already turned in for the night. Did she now? <laughs> It seems my duties were harder than my sister expected. Oh, Celestia, yeah, but for you to do Luna's duties. Moon raised. That's even easier than raising the sun. She has raised What's the moon next? before. Back when she had raised the sun and the moon. Of course. Everyone's <laughs> asleep at night. Well, Luna works alone. Oh, but it's nothing I can't handle. All I have to do is watch over Equestria, visit the Dream Realm, and protect ponies and their nightmares. <laughs> My list was three Even her magic um, color changed. I just realized that. Right. Like, her magic Everybody's color changed to Luna's. You're talking to yourself, Celestia? But there's no pony else to talk to. Ah, <laughs> uh, Celestia's not so used to... Yeah. Luna's probably used to be in the world because she was on the moon for a thousand freaking years. Or moons. Cadence? The Discord. I want to go into Discord's dreams. I want to go into Discord's dream. Go do Doctor Who. I want to go into Discord's dream. Freaking Derpy. What is Derpy doing? I'm trying to figure... Uh, what the fucking hell? <laughs> Okay. Was the wrong call. I was supposed to bring you two closer together, but I've only driven you apart. If you two can't see why you need each other, then then I am back. Oh uh, no, no, nightmare in two point oh. Starlight. I know how to handle Nightmare Moon. Yes, but can you handle? Uh, <laughs> Nightmare Celestia? This can't be. If Nightmare Luna Sun? Nightmare Moon, you can absolutely turn into me, Daybreaker. The better, prettier, and more Daybreaker. powerful okay. version of you. No, I'll never turn into you. Deep inside, you know how powerful you are. You don't Ooh. need Luna. So Celestia has That's a Nightmare sure. Moon version of herself now. I knew I needed Daybreaker. Her. Okay. <laughs> oh, please. You don't need any pony. You can do whatever you want. And all you have to do is get rid of any pony who stands in your way. Okay. <clears throat> I never should have banished you to the moon. I should have destroyed you. No, oh, no. Daybreaker is uh, an interesting so easily, character. Unless you plan on smiling me to smithereens. <laughs> <laughs> Get wrecked. <laughs> I told you I was more powerful than you. Oh, so much black. We get it. You're sad. You could really 
you some sun. Is Celestia making fun of me and willing to be in the email? Well, bye bye. Ground. <laughs> okay then. Dream realm, though, right? That smile's too wide. It's obviously not. Oh, my God, this dream, though. Luna, I get out of that dream. <laughs> God. Why don't you want us to go on our field trip? Oh, I no. Don't. Oh, don't. Okay, I bye mean, bye, teeth. This is creepy as fuck. Oh dear God. Oh. So Celestia and Luna versus Nightmare Moon and Daybreaker. Okay. I want to see it. And Luna help me and Luna's like, no, you got my powers now, it's all you. They both realize both their tasks are more harder to handle than me each time. Okay. Then um Oh no, 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 no sacrificing Nightmare Moon. You can do it, Celestia. You can do it. Yes. Get broken, bitch. <laughs> you did it! Only because you were here. I don't know how you do this alone. Sisters. So, um, did you talk to yourself? Um, a little. <laughs> <laughs> is this really happening? Or is this still a dream? It's in the dream realm, but this can be pretty much done. Welcome back, sister. I know you had a long night, so I made you some pancakes. Hey, oh. best you can do, but hey, uh, still made pancakes. Uh, I thought that counts. They're delicious. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> it's about that counts. Even though I know that face. They're not. I know you have to be perfect for every pony else. And you do an <laughs> amazing job, but you don't have to do it for me. In that case, they are terrible. <laughs> you're right, okay. Jeez, I know. Awful. <laughs> but it means a lot that you tried. I love you, sister. I love you too. So this was real. Oh, <laughs> yeah, it was, was. Not real. And this just happened now and, and not in my dream? I'm so confused. <laughs> <laughs> it's all real. <laughs> it was the right call going with your gut. The map was wise to send you Starlight. No pony else would have been so bold as to do what you did. Or That's would have had the nice ability. I don't I think any of the unicorn knows how to switch up. cutie marks like that. It was just what we needed. The experience I think Starlight's the only one with the ability to do that. <laughs> and now the cutie marks are going to go back Wait, to their I own place. This. Starlight has fulfilled her duties. So who else will be called by the map? Wow. Hey, <laughs> so this is just a friendly visit, not interfering because I was worried. I wasn't. I knew you could do it. I'm so 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 proud of you. <laughs> From after I hyperventilated and don't leave out any details. <laughs> Starlight, save oh, me. <laughs> by the way, there's a field.
field trip you need to make happen in a timber wolf issue you need to address. What? Oh, look, there's the sun. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just like, oh shit, wait, what? <laughs> That episode. <coughs> Sorry about <coughs> coughing. Allergies are gonna be acting up a lot during the season. Not that season of the show, but I meant like this current season is summer or something. You know, rain's coming down and stuff, and that's causing my allergy to. My allergies, my nose get rainy sometimes, but most of all, I've just been coughing a lot. Like I said, you you already guys already seen me coughing a lot, so. Anyways, guys. <laughs> Anyways, guys, thank you all for watching. I hope to um, what is it? See you all next time in the next episode of My Little Pony. Friendship is Magic, Season 7. Um, I'm going to see if season, uh, Episode 11 on here, and if not, you guys aren't really going to see it right now, so... <laughs> but yes. Anyways, guys, thank you all for watching. Have a good day. Oh, wait. I should probably get my thoughts on this. It was a good episode. Okay. Okay. I'll get my real thoughts on it. Daybreaker. A kind of nightmare moon, ver nightmare moonish version of Celestia, that definitely came out of the blue. Uh, <clears throat> so that's what would happen if Celestia, like, I don't know, like, anger toward her sister, was it overcome her? She would turn into freaking Daybreaker. Fucking, I mean, seriously. And two, again, Starlight got called by the map. So, who else will be calling that? Are the main six not being called by it no more? Are we going to get Trixie called by the map for who only cares? I mean, seriously, who... Bulk biceps can call by the map? I'm just kidding. Bulk biceps. I swear if he gets called by the map, that's just going to be way out of the blue. <laughs> he was just like, I can call him by the map. <laughs> he was like... <laughs> You just say, buy my note card, and my job at the spa. You know, I'm trying to do a bulk bicep suppression, but I'm failing at it miserably. Um, so, yeah. Anyways, guys, thank you all for watching. Have a nice day. Take care. This is Joy Allison signing out.